Dear representatives of the OCIC group, dear representatives of Phnom Penh City Hall, dear friends and partners of the Build for People project. And last but not least, dear students of various Phnom Penh universities. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. On behalf of the Federal Ministry of Education and Research, I'd like to welcome you to the kickoff conference of the fourth Echo City Transition Lab on Sustainable Neighborhoods within the framework of the Build for People project. My name is Dr. Verena Hebecker and I'm based on the division or in the Division for Global Change and Climate Research of the Federal Ministry of Education and Research, BMBF. We are promoting research to facilitate the implementation of the Sustainable Development Goals, the SDG and the International Climate Targets. Within its current future research and innovation strategy and the research for sustainability strategy, the Federal Ministry of Education and Research has put a strong focus on sustainable urbanization and climate adaptation for more than 15 years. The results and experiences of former funding programs were fed into the current program, Sustainable Development of Urban Regions, SURE, under which the Build for People project is funded. Ladies and gentlemen, the main goal of the FSURE funding measure is to make urban regions more resilient to the consequences of climate change. Our intention is to show that urbanization oriented towards sustainability is not a contradiction to competitiveness, economic growth and social inclusion. In addition to action-oriented knowledge for practical problem solving, Research is also intended to create non-technical innovations in politics, business and society. In the Build for People project, the relationship between behavioral and environmental dimensions and the combination of urban quality of life with the dimension of urban sustainability are quite challenging and new. The objectives should be realized by a cross-cutting, multi-stakeholder approach that involves not only renowned local universities, but also implementation partners like the Phnom Penh Capital Hall or your today's host, the OCIC Group. An important part of the Echo City Transition Lab in the next days is the transfer of information from research to practice and vice versa. The knowledge transfer between stakeholders from science, politics, urban citizens and corporate sector is an integrative part of the dissemination strategy of the Build for People project. This week, you will also have the opportunity to, to, to discuss the crucial question, how do we transfer our research results quickly and effectively into application in Phnom Penh and beyond. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very happy that the OCIC group is one of the leading developer countries in Cambodia and has decided to join forces with the Build for People team to jointly elaborate new innovative ideas and visions for Phnom Penh. Thank you all for this. And I wish you now all an interesting week with exciting discussions and new ideas for the development of sustainable and resilient neighborhoods. All the best from Germany. Bye bye.